Right guys, welcome back to episode 2 of this Beer Pro playthrough. Um, I think I'm going to call this series One Man vs. The World. As we try and take on, although it is only at the minute, Legion United vs. Kilmarnock. Not exactly the world or the best of opposition, but we'll get there as we go through the career mode. So uh, we come into this third friendly, obviously dropped for the previous one against Wimbledon. Which uh, was quite disappointing after having a decent game against uh, S. Recife. <laughs> I completely forgot we played in the first friendly then. Um, but yeah, we came into this game against Kilmarnock and uh, we were involved heavily straight away, uh, trying to play you know similar football that we did in the uh, the first friendly, trying to uh, not overcomplicate things, but still trying trying to play quite flowing football. I didn't want to sink into like a generic uh, lower league team long ball type situation. So I tried to kind of again drop off, pick the ball up as much as possible and uh, create as many chances as possible and uh, we pick the ball up here on the edge of the box in the 25th minute play it inside, get a cheeky back heel return and then rifle it straight from 25 yards into the top corner and that is our first goal in our pro career and a uh, cheeky little cartwheel for celebration and we do get a couple of accomplishments as well uh, I was actually, considering we rated quite lowly, this was quite an incredible first goal absolutely smashed it pinpoint accuracy in off the post in the top right hand corner and I was delighted to get off the mark with that and uh, six minutes later we got a free kick on the edge of the box fantastic free kick from Austin uh, comes back off the bar, didn't quite cross the line but uh, Lees managed to uh, get his head on the end of the ball for uh, the rebound and put his 2 up and then Ross McCormack, Ross McCormack, Ross McCormack came on for Luke Varney which uh, was pleasing actually because Varney was being played up top with us uh, instead of Luciano Becchio and uh, obviously McCormack took our place in the previous friendly but this time now we managed to stay on the field and uh, he was involved straight away. I had a, f a quick shot with my uh, left foot, picking the ball up off the defender, and the uh, keeper saves it, gets a rebound, and McCormack finishes it and then appears to bow down to me in this celebration, which uh, I was quite pleased with, even though it was probably just a glitch. But uh, we get a, a corner later on in the second half. Ball comes in, managed to uh, get free with a little bit of movement, get in front of the defender, and uh, Almost a diving header, kind of a jump and lean, almost stumbling over because the balance stats aren't too high, but we get our second goal of the game, and that is how the game finished. 4-0, home win against Kilmarnock in the last um, in the last friendly, and uh, a 9.7 overall rating, which was uh, very, very impressive. And uh, after scoring two goals and having an almost perfect 10 out of 10 rating, the manager sends me an email saying, I think you should go out on loan. And uh, I was pretty pissed off, to be completely honest. I thought we'd done enough to, you know, hold our own in a in a championship side, but apparently we had not. Hartlepool came in with the first loan offer, and um, I thought if I'm going to drop down a division, I don't really want to go to someone that uh, is going to be mid to low table. So I rejected the offer from Hartlepool, and then Notts County came in, and they're kind of a team that could be uh, pushing for the playoffs. So uh, I did accept that loan offer. We're going to drop down a division to League One. Uh, picked up a 15G achievement for going out on loan or transferring to another club in the uh, Beer Pro seasons. And uh, we've got some new league objectives in this League One season. They want me to score 24 goals, uh, get 8 assists, maintain a shot conversion rate of 29% or more, and have an average uh, match rating of 8.4, which is actually going to be pretty fucking hard. Uh, 24 goals for someone that's rated quite low is going to be, def well, it's definitely going to be very difficult, but we were thrown straight into the first team for the first game. Uh, away in the uh, Capital One Cup, the Cock, away at uh, fucking Peterborough United, who I absolutely despise being a Cambridge fan. So, uh, and also they're a, they're a league above us, their Championship, and we play in away in our rather fetching black and uh, orange striped kit. Uh, and by fetching, I mean disgusting. And uh, somehow Hughes manages to miss that chance and uh, skew skewed it wide winter from a basically open goal and at uh, half time still no nil nothing much really happened first half thought I'd check on Leeds one and up against Stevenage you know got to keep in touch with the parent club and uh, I tried to uh, well you tell me is that or is that not a penalty steps across catches me above the knee I go down and ref just waves play on and we get absolutely nothing for it and uh, thought luck was just going to be against us we come here in the uh, 67th minute pick the ball up with a lucky deflection and um, actually managed to put it in the bottom there into uh, the bottom corner of the net it kind of trickled in and balance went again and we kind of fell over but they all count as they say and it goes into the back of the net and we get our first goal four knots county in a, a professional game that uh, isn't a friendly, you know, a competitive game. Somehow Swanson manages to miss that chance and not get it on target. So uh, we get let off there, really. 
and uh, into the 89th minute I kind of I had plenty of options there to pass it and I decided to be greedy and try and rifle it with my left foot and uh, missed and it kind of serves me right because <laughs> 30 seconds later I limped off with a pulled hamstring and uh, Francois Zoko took my place on the field on the field on the field but uh, that's kind of how the game ended 1-0 with a late goal and uh, 8.3 rating overall very very impressed with that not bad for our uh, first game at Notts County making a good impression or so I thought making a good impression uh, we get uh, they kind of give you four match blocks and uh, objectives for four match blocks they want a match rating of 6.7 want me to score one goal which is fine you know a shot conversion rate of 21% and uh, get at least one assist from four games that should be fine but we were dropped for the game against Carlisle and uh, which we subsequently lost 2-1 at home so that was very annoying but uh, we will come back next time and the game uh, the next game is against Sheffield United I think so uh, I will see you in the next episode leave this video a like if you could be so kind subscribe if you haven't for more and I will see you next time